Hey guys, it's anything Korean, and we are back today with K-pop do's and don'ts. I feel like there isn't good need to address this because so many things happening in K-pop in this whole entire year. To be honest, that is just like I know some people go pretty extreme, so I'm just like, okay, guys. Well, today we'll start with our don'ts. Don't because I know there's a lot. Number one. Don't be a Sasang fan. <laughs> Pretty much just a Sasang fan is like, it's so, they're like the extremists of fans. Like, they will go and they will pretty much stalk their idol to the very ends of this earth. And it's pretty much they're there to destroy your idol's life, okay? Oh. That is pretty much how they are. And they probably will hurt them. I don't know. Some of them are a little crazy. I'll probably post like a video link somewhere that has like a whole documentary <laughs> on how that's the same man works because yeah. it gets pretty hectic. <laughs> don't claim them as yours. Like don't claim idols as yours because that's also part of being pretty creepy in a way. But, but it's just, yeah, some people go really extreme with that. Like I know like some, like for example, like whenever GD like had um, his stuff with like like that one Japanese model and then everybody's like oh my god like I can't believe she's like he's with her she's not that good looking and I was like shut up like they both like okay first of all she's a model for a reason and second of all like I don't think she really cares like he's probably going to be with someone that he likes <laughs> so why do you need to speak for that like they could they know who they like and whatever and people are just like no, they don't. Like, no, they, they shouldn't don't. be together or whatever. I mean, like, that's with every idol. Like, a lot of people think, like, you shouldn't be with them. You shouldn't be with them. And that's why, like, a lot of idols, like, they hide their relationships because they can't just, like, come out and be like, hey, I'm dating this person because if not, the other person that they're dating mm -hmm. gets so much hate. Yeah, and especially get, if it's, like, a celebrity. Yeah, or they get hate, too. Yeah. You should at least be supporting them and be like, Good job, congrats, like yay, support them, support them. I know, like ship them. Yeah. Because I like mean. like honestly, like I hype Jackie up in her relationship, okay? Okay. <laughs> fetishize don't fetishize your idols. Oh well, pretty much just cause like, you know how K pop's like mainly like Asians. So like yeah, just don't fetishize Asians. But, like that's just really creepy in a way. Like if you're only gonna be in a relationship with just because they're Asian, then and because you like K-pop, that's that's not good. Like, yeah, like honestly, that's not a relationship. Because they, even though we all want that cute K-pop idol boyfriend. <laughs> yeah, but there's other people in the world that they like, probably are like they like you and they they want to be with you and, and stuff just like that. I'm not Asian. I can't be with them. I know. That's me. That's so me. Don't watch the YouTube videos only for views, please. Yes. Watch it because you enjoy the song. Watch videos because not because like the group is so like awesome, they're so popular. Also watch groups that are not like, they just came out, they debuted it or they're unrated. Watch them. Like just because they have a thousand views doesn't mean you can't watch someone that has a hundred views. Like watch every group, support every group. You never know if like the... The most popular group can come out with the not the best song like that you thought it would come and maybe one unready song I mean group came out with the most like hype song that you liked and you would never know really because you never really went out there and explored other groups or other fandoms so don't bash older idols okay like 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 okay honestly I'm like I have been a Big Bang fan for like they probably started but like I know there's people that they like, came into K-pop and like who are these oldies and whatever and I was like what the heck they okay I know you don't know them but it's just like they literally helped your group to be no noticed no. Yeah. <laughs> like I mean, other K-pop groups have done that but Bang Bang has to see a lot and they've been like it's not like, I guess, not only Bang Bang, but other, you know, K-pop Yeah, like groups, Super older. Junior and like, especially even older ones like H.O.T. and like Shinhua. I highly recommend you watch Shinhua broadcast because that's how I became a fan. <laughs> recommend that. Put the link up. I will put that link down below. It's a good show to watch. <laughs> but yeah, like, I just, I don't understand why you guys have to bash them for like being like, you know, older than all the other idols because 
Like, they literally, like, started helping it become international. Yeah. So, like, we wouldn't be doing this channel if it weren't for them. True. Yeah, we wouldn't even really- I wouldn't really know that much about them. I wouldn't even get into K-pop, because I learned about K-pop through, like, uh, social media. So. Yeah, that's practically how it went. Mm -hmm. And if you guys start bashing them, I was like, what the heck? Why is there even a point to that? Like, it's- I know it's sad when people see, like, oh, why is these people continuing to make music after, like, these many years? years? And I was like, that's- Because they are kings, okay? So, for our last point, don't take K-pop so seriously. Don't. Like, Just, I don't know, like, we also have lives outside of K-pop. Yeah. Probably, like, you have to take care of yourself as well. <laughs> yeah, don't think K-pop is your priority. Just, like, we're students too, like, we like K-pop, but we also, like, we have to study, do homework, Yeah, work, like, we have, like, like goals that. to get to, like, I'm trying to be a doctor up here, <laughs> and y'all gonna see me in the future, hoping y'all. But anyway, <laughs> but, yeah, like, it's just, you, like, I know, as a K-pop fan, like, you probably should set goals for yourself in like real life okay like I, like I know some of you guys be like streaming things like for so long just like you guys even like drink water or like eat food or anything like that like do you, take well, care of yourself take care yes of yourself. on to the do's <laughs> yes so for our first do is support the idols the number one thing <laughs> number one thing support the idols support the idols in the most positive way that you can Yes. Don't because harm them. They really need it. Yeah. <laughs> Especially because, like, during their training times, they've probably been having, like, harsh criticism. I mean, like, if you're in entertainment anyway, you're gonna be criticized, first of all, but, like, just in person, like, you're gonna be criticized by, like, people who are gonna train you and stuff like that. And then, like, if you, like, even if you do it online and you criticize people, it's just, like, ugh, it's, like, it makes it even worse. Like, it makes it yeah. Even having more anxiety and stuff like that, I'm just like, oh my yeah, god. Yeah, like, like, su like support them because they like kind of did give up their own childhood and like their own, their own life, life really for to entertain us and like they kind of want to give have that effort and love back from us to show that wow, this was really worth it. Like you know. Mm -hmm. Next do is that we have not done yet is go to their concerts. Yeah. We get to go to a concert. Because guess where we're at, guys? Colorado, nobody yes. comes. Oh no. Uh, yeah. But do try to go to a concert. Yeah, if you live in those states that they come in there, try and go to it. Try. Like, Even save up some money to go. Like, oh, you don't have to buy, like, the most expensive the ticket. The like... patch picture <laughs> one. No, just go and enjoy the song. Like, see them in real life. Like, that's everybody, everybody, every K-pop fan's goal is to see their idol in real life. Pretty much. Like, I have not seen any idol in real life, so I'm just kind of like, yeah. So our goal is to go to a concert soon, so stay tuned for that. You guys. Yeah, stay tuned and you may see us there. Maybe in the nearby future. Yes. Respect idols' privacy. Please, please. Yes. Just, just because, just because they're famous and we know everything about them doesn't mean there's parts of their life that they want to keep private. Like, like we mentioned before, dating. But we also mentioned like they want to go out with their family. They want to go out shopping. They haven't seen their parents mm -hmm. for years because they they live in different. Uh, areas in Korea, you or know, or maybe even Asia, like, yeah, or even out of state, or out, out of the, the country. country. Sorry, <laughs> <laughs> like out of the state. Like, well, guys, that's been all the do's and the don'ts. So I know you guys are probably mad, happy, supported, or just haters, but yeah, we just want to give this out because, like Makila said, K-pop is changing a lot, and yeah, it's, it's not the same yeah. anymore. I know, like, it's getting getting out of hand, like, really fast, and, like, it used to be a peaceful world, I mean, it was kind of peaceful, but is that was kind of like, fan wars happening, and all of that kind of jibber-jabbering things, and I'm just like, oh god, like, I don't, like, I don't even want to comment on, like, YouTube comments, or, I don't want to comment on YouTube videos or anything like that, because people are just like, you don't know who that is, <sighs> I know, it's scary to say like, your opinion now these days, okay. so. I mean, if you guys really liked this video and thought what we said, or even have any more things, add below and share this video. 
share it so people can know the truth about it. And please like it. <laughs> yes. Please. Like this video if you got to this point. Yes. yes. <laughs> Well, uh, but anyway, guys, if it's been anything Korean, and please like, comment, share, subscribe to our channel. See you guys next time.